female reproductive system consists of a pair of ovaries, a pair of oviducts, fallopian tubes, uterus, vagina, external genitalia, and a pair of mammary glands. Ovaries are the primary sex organs of a female. They are solid structures located in the lower part of the abdomen. It is connected by ligaments to the uterus and lateral pelvic wall. Each ovary is 2 to 4 cm long and 2 cm wide. It is composed of connective tissue called stroma, covered by a layer of germinal epithelium. Stroma has an outer cortex and an inner medulla. The ovarian cortex contains some rounded bodies, named follicles at various stages of development. Each follicle contains an ovum. Fallopian tubes or oviducts are narrow tubes, about 10 to 12 centimeters long, connecting the ovary to the uterus. Each oviduct is differentiated into three parts, infundibulum, ampulla, and isthmus. Infundibulum is the funnel-shaped proximal part, and has finger-like projections called fimbriae at its margin. Fimbriae are very close to the ovaries and receive the egg released from the ovaries. After release, the egg enters the fallopian tube. Tiny hairs in the tube's lining help push it down a narrow passageway, towards the uterus. Ampulla is the wider part of the oviduct next to infundibulum. It is lined by ciliated epithelium. Isthmus is the short, narrow and straight part that follows the ampulla and connects with the uterus. The uterus is a hollow, muscular and inverted pear-shaped structure. It is also known as the womb. It is located in the pelvic cavity between the urinary bladder and the rectum. The uterus is attached to the body wall by a double fold of peritoneum called myometrium. It has an upper dome-shaped part, fundus, middle large part corpus and a lower narrow cervix that projects into the vagina. Implantation of embryo occurs in the uterine fundus. It is the site of fetal growth during pregnancy. The cervix is composed of powerful sphincter muscles. It is strong enough to hold the weight of the fetus and amniotic fluid against the pull of gravity during pregnancy. The cavity of the cervix is called the cervical canal. The uterus has a thick wall made of three tissues, an outer peritoneal covering called parametrium, a middle layer of smooth muscles myometrium and, an inner glandular layer endometrium. The myometrium is involved in uterine contractions. The endometrium undergoes cyclic changes during the menstrual cycle. Vagina is an elastic muscular tube, about 7.5 cm long, that connects the cervix of the uterus, to the exterior of the body by the vaginal opening. The cervical canal along with vagina forms the birth canal. During menstruation, the menstrual flow exits the body via the vagina. Menstruation is a woman's monthly normal vaginal bleeding, often called the period.